All right, guys, just doing some further testing on the prototype that I told you about. Um, I've learned some interesting things about this amplifier. Uh, first thing I can say, um, definitely satisfied with it. That's the first thing. Um, next, I did a few tests just to see, you know, how it operates. Does it get hot at idle? Does it warm up on the power side or the output side? I've been doing a little small tests like that. I've also been turning my truck on and off to see if it will pop upon turn on. So I've done that about 10 times, comes on and everything is fine. But what I did notice about this board is when I turn the amp on, uh, cause I don't know if you, are, you guys know, but the PC, the PCB in these boards I've divided into two sections for reliability. So when I turn this amplifier on, what happens is the power comes on and then I think there's like a five second delay and I think the output side comes on. So I think the power is generated through the power, uh, the power PCB and then the output side PCB comes on. So it's like a uh, two part or two step process when the amplifier comes on. That's what I've noticed, because it comes on, five seconds later, it makes a click, and then the output side comes on. So I can say that's a good thing. Um, also, I've noticed, uh, I think yesterday, I had this app running for an hour and 25 minutes on idle, and I touched it, you know, on the power side. Power side was cool. It gets, I wouldn't even say it gets warm, on the output side, but the temperature goes up. It doesn't get, it's like less than warm. Uh, and like I said, that's with the amp being at idle for an hour and 25 minutes, all right? Um, and if you guys didn't know, these uh, amplifiers will be strappable. So it has the ability to be strapped and that will definitely be a good function to have with this big board. Also, um, I talked to my supplier. These are currently eight gauge outputs. And like I said, this is the prototype. These are gonna get changed to four gauge outputs. All right, that's gonna get changed to four gauge outputs. Um, and maybe some other cosmetic changes to it as well. But so far, right now at this point, I'm definitely liking how this amplifier operates. And I'm starting to be pretty confident with it. I'm going to get another one and I'm going to test both of these amplifiers strapped as well. So, uh, like I said, this is small beginnings moving forward slowly. Um, and hopefully soon, um, you will see this app looking a lot different, but I'm going to have the prototypes in my truck because this is going to be something that I want to have as what you would say history to my new beginnings, you know? So this is gonna be like the very first of the line of apps that I have coming out. But like I say, nothing comes quick. You do something quick, you're gonna have failed results. So I'm taking my time with this. I'm studying this app. I'm trying to see things that I don't like about it and have it changed or make improvements so I don't have problems or customers have problems. So this is just an update um, on a prototype. Like I said, I'm gonna have two of them. And this amp, it is stable at half ohm on a musical load. So you will be able to run this amplifier at half ohm, all right? For you guys that like to run lower ohm loads to fight impedance. But that's just an update. Hope you guys like it. And as y'all know, it has four powers, four grounds, and like I said, this set up now it's not going to look like this like i said i'm in testing stages and i'm actually going to have both of these prototypes i'm going to be going to shows with these prototypes too just so i can see uh how they perform you know in the heat um uh, in between demos does it get hot in the heat all that stuff so instead of just getting something uh making changes on it and just throwing it out in the market um I like to do things a little different. So uh, hopefully 
everything comes out right and we can get this show on the road. But like I said, it's not going to be a quick process. I'm taking my time with this and hopefully once it's out on the market, I hope you guys are happy. All right, that's my update on the prototype.